वक्रतुंड महाकाय सूर्यकोटि समप्रभ निर्विघ्न कुर्मी देव सर्वकार्यु सर्वता ओ हेलो माय डियर लवली किडोज हाउ आर यू ऑल टुडे वेलकम टू योर इंग्लिश लिटरेचर वीडियो क्लासेस एंड वी आर डूइंग आवर रिविजन्स थ्रू द रिविजन शीट राइट I hope you all have started studying for your exams and you are doing your revisions accordingly and filling up the revision sheet right so we have done lesson number 1 which is back to school we have finished lesson number 2 which is wonderful nature and now we are going to do lesson number 3 Which is the world of magic? Now, do you remember this lesson? हमने इसमें क्या करा था कौन सी स्टोरी करी थी हमने इसमें कौन सी स्टोरी करी थी वी डिड द स्टोरी ऑफ अलादीन डू यू रिमेंबर अलादीन एंड द मैजिक लैम्प एंड इस स्टोरी में क्या था देर वॉज अ बॉय नेम्ड अलादीन वन डे अ विकेड मजिशियन जो कि उसका अंकल बन के ही केम टू हिज हाउस एंड सेड दैट ही इज अंकल ऑफ अलादीन एंड ही गेव सच स्टोरीज विच मेड अलादीन टू बिलीव दैट ही इज हिज अंकल एंड ही सेड अलादीन वन डे दैट कम विद मी टू अ प्लेस इफ यू डू वॉट आई से आई विल गिव यू लॉट्स ऑफ मनी विथ विच यू कैन बाय your own shop in the city and you can live happily right so they together went to the cave and wahan jaane ke baad the magician said okay fine go inside the cave in the forest and bring me the lamp lamp mein se pour all the oil out and do not touch anything else except the lamp and then as soon as aladdin took the lamp and he came out what did the magician said he said first give me the lamp and then i'll pull you out but aladdin said no no first pull me out and then i will give you the lamp so this way they were arguing and the stone fell on the mouth of the cave cave ke muh ke upar stone gir gaya एंड केव का दरवाज़ा बंद हो गया एंड देन अलादीन बिकेम वेरी वरिड कि मैं बाहर कैसे जाऊँगा एंड वाइल ही वॉज वेरी वरिड वॉट डिड ही डू वॉट डिड अलादीन डू विद द लैम्प द अलादीन वॉज क्राइंग एंड हिज टीयर्स फेल ऑन द लैम्प सो ही रब्ड द लैम्प टू वाइप ऑफ द टीयर्स एंड द जीनी अपियर्ड एंड देन जीनी आस्ट वट वट इज योर कमांड your command is order for me make wish so what did aladdin wish aladdin wished to go back home to his mother and he was hungry so when they went home the genie took aladdin to home and after going home uh, his mother was very delighted so what is the meaning of delighted that means she was very happy so uh, aladdin said okay mother let's have food so he asked jinni he made a wish to bring good food for them and then the jinni brought food for them and they started living happily so this was the story of aladdin in the lesson right okay and then we did a poem also poem about rainbow fairies isn't it okay now in this lesson we had we did the phonic word of nk and nt nk sounds as ank right pink sink drink stink plank monk tank right and nt sounds as ant that is a u n t ant a n t ant P L A N T plant. Um, then we have T E N T tent. 
we have R A N T rent, P O I N T point, right? Okay. Now let's come to the revision sheet. Here you have to in this one you have to circle the right picture. So which what do you think? What is the what is this picture? This picture is of monk. So what is the spelling of monk? M O N K. Sorry, this is not monk. This is something very stinky. That is stink. Bad badbudar. See, that boy is holding something very away from his hand, and he made faces. So this is stink. Badbudar. So spelling of stink is S T I N K. Stink. So we circle stink. Now in number two, this boy is honking. That honking मतलब वो एक blow horn आता है ना भोंपु के जैसे उसको दबाओ तो that honks, the truck honks, right? So this is honk, H O N K honk. Now what is this? What do you think? This is a tank, right? Fish tank होता है ना वैसे ही tank, T A N K tank. Now in this picture, the boy is drinking from the glass, right? So D R I N K drink. Now in this picture, this is elephant ka head, right? So what is the uh, elephant ka suit ko hum kya bolate English mein? We call it as trunk right so we circle trunk now what is this this is a monk monk matlab um, buddhist sadhu hote hai na wo log ko monk bolte hai so we circle monk m o n k monk now what is this this is a sink jo wash basin hota hai usko hum sink bulate hain so what is the spelling of sink S I N K sink. See, सब में एन के है ना लास्ट में अंक अंक वाला साउंड आ रहा है इंक सिंक टैंक राइट ओके नाउ दिस इज अ पीस ऑफ केक केक में से भी जो छोटा सा पीस निकलता है दैट इज कॉल्ड एज चंक चंक ऑफ केक और चंक ऑफ चीज सो सी एच चो यू एन के अंक चंक Now next is this girl is winking. Winking मतलब आँख मारना, right? So W I N K wink. Now this elephant, this animal is skunk. Skunk is a very stinky kind of animal. और वो डरता है ना, so he releases gas. So skunk is a stinky animal. Now this is a two-layer bed. ऊपर भी bed है and नीचे भी bed है. When you grow up and you go to hostels, hostels में generally ऐसे beds मिलते हैं. Or you must have seen in movies also hostels में ऐसे ऊपर नीचे bed होता है ना. So this is known as bunk, bunker bed. This is called bunker bed. So we circle bunk, B-U-N-K bunk. Now next is this is a clown and the clown is also known as <coughs> bonker so we circle bonk b o n k bonk right now this is a crossword puzzle in question number b whereby you have to find the spellings in the crossword क्रॉसवर्ड में आपको स्पेलिंग्स फाइंड करने हैं सो बेस्ट वे इज वॉट यू कैन डू इज यू कैन नंबर इट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स 
7 8 and 9 so it is uh, I know uh, if you have a good printout it's good okay if you don't have a good Xerox where if where you cannot find words then also it's okay but I have a Xerox which is not very neat but still I have found out the words for you कुछ words मैंने ढूंढे हैं कुछ words आपको ढूंढ रहे हैं right so you have to help me out to find the words now first is student s t u d e n t student right n t है ना last में n t वाला आवाज so this one see one two three fourth line में fourth line में it is starting with student s t stir u d e n t student right now number two is rodent rat is also known as rodent so line number this was four so five six seven line number seven ka first letter is r and we circle it r o d e n t rodent now number three is plant plant me see ye rodent ke upar wala jo line aega na ये वाला इसमें ऊपर देखो P है ना P L A N T plant circle the plant right then we have A N T ant ant कौन सा है picture number eight we find it A N T ant then we have what do we have We also have infant which is baby. I N F A N T infant. Small baby is also known as infant. Right. So this much uh, and also the last seven number P R E S I D E N T president. So this much I have found out for you. Whichever is remaining. Kya kya bach kya? Tent. Point. And Trident. Ye teen, you have to find it for me. Your ma'am is not able to find it out. So you have to find it for me, which is your homework. Right? Okay. Now coming to next question. Here is question and answers. Who came to Aladdin's house one day and what did he say? Who came to Aladdin's house one day? An old man came to Aladdin's house one day. He said, he said that he is uncle of Aladdin right this is what he said now question number two what plan did old man had for Aladdin Aladdin ke liye kya plan tha old man ke pas what did he say the old man had a plan The old man had planned to buy a shop for Aladdin <coughs> in the city. If Aladdin agrees to help him 
to get what he wants. That is, उसने plan किया था ये बोला था I have a plan for you that if you help me to get what I want, I will buy you a shop in the city. Okay. Now what did the father son said? So this is your question from the poem. So do you remember what did the father son said? Do you remember the poem? Rainbow fairies? So the old father son said The father son said inverted commas never mind my dears I will send my little fairy folk to dry your falling tears inverted comma close so basically the clouds were crying right because they bumped their head and they felt the pain so what happened they were crying so the father son said to the clouds that don't wear don't worry and never mind koi baat nahi it's okay Fic tension mat lo i will send my little fairy folk to dry your falling tears aapke aankhon se girte hue aansu ko pochne ke liye main aapke fairies mein फेरी फेरीज को भेजता हूँ राइट ओके नाउ फोर्थ वन नेम द ऑथर ऑफ द पोएम हु इज द ऑथर ऑफ द पोएम ऑथर ऑफ द पोएम इज रिटन एट द एंड ऑफ द पोएम सो लेट्स फाइंड Okay, now in the book, the author of the poem is not mentioned. See, we have the poem over here, but the author of the poem is not mentioned, right? यहाँ पे नहीं दिया है कि author of the poem कौन है. So we cancel this question. We will not answer this question because author तो दिया ही नहीं है. So how can we write it, right? Okay, now question number D is your homework. and you will love to do it what why because you have to color the picture aapko ye picture color karna hai so now let's do the feelings and emotions ka work right in the revision sheet which is your question number e now since we don't have much space over here we are going to write it the numbers down so in number 1 we have Laura is dashed because she lost her job. So, किसी का job चला जाए तो that person is worried. So, Laura is worried. She lost her job. Now, number two, the boy is happy because he won prize at school. अगर किसी को prize मिले तो that person is happy. Number three, the man saw a thief, so he is scared. Three, कोई डर जाएगा ना अगर उसको थीव देख ले तो नंबर फोर शी इज डैस बिकॉज शी हर्ड अ जोक शी इज अम्यूज नंबर फोर ना नंबर फाइव द मैन इज थॉटफुल देर इज टू मच ऑन हिज माइंड बहुत सारा कुछ दिमाग में चल रहा है सो द मैन इज थॉटफुल नाउ नंबर सिक्स जिम इज डैश बिकॉज ही कैंट फाइंड हिज मोबाइल जेम इज डिजअपॉइंटेड ना क्या कहते हैं उसको उदास हो गया है 
क्योंकि उसको उसका मोबाइल नहीं मिल रहा नाउ नंबर सेवन मिया इज डैश टूडे शी डजेंट फील लाइक डूइंग एनीथिंग मिया क्या है बोर्ड हो गई है आज वो वो उसको कुछ करने का इच्छा नहीं है नंबर एट मैक्स लुक्स वेरी डैश ही हैजेंट ईटन एनीथिंग मैक्स जो है बहुत भूखा दिख रहा है मैक्स लुक्स हंगरी ना नंबर नाइन माई नेबर इज वेरी डैश बिकॉज माई म्यूजिक इज लाउड नेबर इज हिस्टेरिकल सो वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ हिस्टेरिकल हिस्टेरिकल मीन्स इमोशनली डिस्टर्ब हो जाना परेशान हो जाना ना नंबर टेन टेन में वी हैव बेला इज ड्रिंकिंग टू मच वाटर शी इज वेरी थर्स्टी बेला बहुत प्यासी है इसलिए शी इज ड्रिंकिंग टू मच वाटर नंबर टेन थर्स्टी ना नंबर इलेवन लुकस इज डैश बिकॉज ही हैज एन गॉट इज फेवरेट टॉय लुकस इज एंग्री गुस्सा है वो क्योंकि ही हैज एन गॉट हिज फेवरेट टॉय नंबर ट्वेल्थ डेविड हैज जस्ट फिनिश्ड वर्क ही इज एग्जॉस्टेड Exhausted is very tired. Do you remember from the lesson Gulliver? Gulliver में tired था ना meaning exhausted का मतलब right? Okay. Now question number F. This is your homework. Put a question mark or full stop and rewrite the sentence. Question mark या full stop लगा के आपको sentence फिर से लिखना है in the correct way. Now this is your homework. so f and d is your homework right so see you in the next class till then take care and do your work